During a briefing on Hurricane Florence Tuesday, President Trump called the U.S. response to Hurricane Maria in Puerto Rico last year a, quote, incredible unsung success. Nearly 3,000 people died during Maria and in the aftermath, and now we're hearing a response from the island's governor. David Begno has the response. He joins us now from Myrtle Beach, South Carolina. Hi, David. What can you tell us? Hi there. So we're in Myrtle Beach because we're covering uh, Hurricane Florence. But as soon as I got word of what the president said today, I immediately reached out to the governor's office in San Juan. It has taken them a few hours to come up with a response. Uh, I can tell you from sources, uh, they went back and forth on exactly what they wanted to say and how strong they wanted to say it. Here it is. And I'm going to read it to you in full. Quote, no relationship between a colony and the federal government can ever be called a success called successful because Puerto Ricans lack certain inalienable rights enjoyed by our fellow Americans in the states. The historical relationship between Puerto Rico and Washington is unfair and un-American. It is certainly not a successful relationship. Mm. This was the worst natural disaster in our modern history. Our basic infrastructure was devastated. Thousands of our people lost their lives and many others still struggle. Now is not the time to pass judgment. It is a time to channel every effort to improve the lives of over 3 million Americans in Puerto Rico. There is work that needs to be finished before we can completely move on to a different stage in the recovery. I am still expecting the president's response to our petition to extend 100 percent federal coverage of categories A and B to complete the unfinished work on the emergency housing restoration programs and debris removal. This reconstruction is a pivotal moment in our history. It will be a way to pave a new and stronger Puerto Rico. Listen, here's the bottom line. I can tell you from multiple sources that the governor of Puerto Rico has made a calculated decision not to criticize the president of the United States. It's that simple. What's in it for the governor? The governor wants Puerto Rico, Puerto Rico to be a state. He wants it to be the next state in the United States, right? It would be a game changer for Puerto Rico. So in a moment like this, when Puerto Ricans are outraged, and let me tell you something, after spending much of the last year covering Puerto Rico, when I put out the remarks that the president said today, Tanya, I have to tell you, there are close to 500 responses across all of my social media platforms and people are blisteringly angry. Yeah. I mean, literally fuming. So um, I think this statement from the governor is going to disappoint some people. It won't be enough for some people, but I just wanted to put that context in there as to why he's not coming out and perhaps delivering a stronger response. David Begno, thank you so much for the context around all of this. You bet.